Well, been having another look and at a couple of the websites and there we go. Something pops up. Ah, uh, here we go. It's a GPX 6000, um, $1,578. And that's, it says lot, 10 pieces. Right, so if you buy 10 pieces of these, that's what you get them for each. But the thing is, they are not real. The, these are knockoffs again. They're made to look real. They are fake. There is no way known that anyone in the universe will get a wholesale price on these like that. It's just absolutely impossible. So, you know, where does it come from? China, right? My God, you know, it's just blatant, isn't it? It is just really badly blatant. Um, you know, what a thing to do to people, you know. There's a reputation that goes with all these uh, detectors um, all around the world, and then we just go, oh, we'll just make some th something that looks like it, fill it up with some, you know, electronics, and say, oh, it's a real one. It's genuine. It's not genuine. It's no way known is that genuine. It's another knockoff. And if you look here, look. There they are. That one. $2,400, no. $2,300, no. Another, another 6,000 sitting there. Look at that. Oh, 1,262. What a discount off six grand. Fantastic. Um, my God, you know, 7,000. $2,368. No, it's not the right thing. It's not. Oh, dear me. It really is. This must be a lot of 10 here for 22412 So you do a lot of 10, you you probably profit $20,000 from that, $2,000 it costs to make the things because they're not genuine and they don't have the real stuff inside. They won't have the performance. And uh, it is dupe people. You know, like I say, this needs to be really pushed out through the detecting forums um, everywhere in the world, every country, so that people don't get duped by this, these fake knockoffs. It really, really is bad, you know. Even that thing there, you know, it's a 5,000 there, right? It's not a 5, I bet you it's not a 5,000. Let's click on it and see what it is. No, it's not. Um... A 5000 for $1,246, 10 piece lot. No, 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 no. Rubbish. Absolute rubbish. You know? This is this is really bad. This is this is um massive scamming. Um yeah, unbelievable. You know, it it comes down to with metal detectors, um mine lab detectors, you are taking a huge risk. If you buy anything out of China or on these Chinese um, websites, you are taking a massive risk, in my opinion, right? I'll say in my opinion, as that is a, a legal disclaimer, because you are allowed by law to have an opinion. So <laughs> that's the only reason I say that. You know, there's a lot of stuff here which is most likely real it's real whatever it is um i don't know but it it really that is just like mine lab had the problem before and they went and cleaned it all up uh and now it's it, just before christmas you know how opportunistic it's all coming out again you know there we are i've, I've you know it, it's just um amazing well that's my um my, all my videos, look at all my videos there. That's only one page. What is there? 242 videos I've done on metal detectors over the years. That's a lot of detectors, isn't it? A lot of uh, videos on detectors. But there you go. Like all these fakey things. My God, you know, more of it. Just click, click, click. Um, yeah, there's another one there. Uh, I'm not going to mention that web that website, but uh, it should know better. Um, well, you know. They, maybe they don't know. They think it's, you know, here we are. What have we got? Original gold detector, GPZ7000. Um, in stock price, 
US $500 to $700 a unit <clears throat> minimum order two units so you get you get um, thieved twice um, there we go production capacity 10 hundred thousand million billion <laughs> units um, yeah there you go pay with Western Union <laughs> see how that goes moneygram Bitcoin how about um, bank deposit you know something legit how about PayPal <laughs> anything that's got a comeback on it they won't use they're going to use if you use um you know these things here western union money gram you've got no comeback on it they'll just go and cash it that's it then bye bye and uh, you know you'll never in in my opinion you'll never be able to talk to the person that sold it to you and uh they'll just be laughing all the way to the bank or from the bank should i say and uh buying themselves a big uh, feed of peking duck that night but uh, that is just really, really bad. Um, you know damn well, just through common sense, it's not real. It's not real. You know, I'm just having a look. What else do they do? You know, this one here. Bluetooth speakers, solar panels, electric bike. So, yes, yeah, definitely not a metal detector company. Uh, yeah. I could say a lot of stuff about a lot of the detector products, but I'm not going to. Um, even if you're dead right and you're telling the truth, it can still make your life uncomfortable when they they start. Um, basically, if you start cutting their lunch and they don't make as much money and they can't rip off people as much as what they were, um, they'll they'll go after you and then you've got to defend yourself. But uh, they, they haven't got a leg to stand on because you know we'll just go to the manufacturer and say. Uh, Go to Code and Mine Lab. Hey, um, are these um, real? Are these ones? Did you sell um, or supply these to this company in China to uh, remarket? And I know damn well Mine Lab's going to go no. <laughs> gonna, they're going to tell me what they always tell me. They're all fake, right? So that's that's from Mine Lab. They've told me um, many a times in the past that uh, all the five thousands and forty five hundreds and things that were being made a few years ago were all fake and they went and cleaned it all up um you know then you got these oh dear me that's a, a, G, a gde f or whatever it's called something or other um yeah i'm not making comment on any of those i don't need to i think it's plainly obvious um why they ever painted the box brown for i don't know um, any colour but brown. You know, go leave that on a mullet pile and you never see it again. Uh, <laughs> it'll disappear into the background. But, yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. Um, like, these detectors here, like these MD4080s and things like that, they actually do work. They're not um, high-end, like, you know, 50 bucks Australian for that. And you know, forty-one dollars for that, um, some something or other. But the the basic circuitry in these detectors, it actually does work. They're only VLF; they won't go very deep through the um, you know mineralized uh, ground such as the gold fields. So I wouldn't use it as a um, um, <clears throat> a gold detector as such. It might be your right for poking around the beach or something or parks. But uh, yeah, gee. You know, I'll just I'll just click on this one here. Just see if they're still selling five thousands and things. Yes, yeah, so they are. There's one there. There's one there. There's another one there. Um, uh, here we go. Original GFX seven thousand. Oh well, I know I know it, it's a dead ringer for, but uh, um, parts thereof. Um, hmm. Yeah, what an industry, eh? What an industry we are in. All these bits and pieces. So, yeah, there's just lots of stuff there. It's a mix of legit stuff and a mix of knockoffs. And uh, it's very hard to um, discern what is what. Yeah. Some of the stuff here, some, some new stuff I've seen actually turn up. Um... 
there you go. They're selling selling Mylar strips. GPX 5000. Um, they've got displays. You want a display? Um, you can get a display and a board, but I think uh, for memory, if you actually plug this into your detector, it'll come up with GFX something. Um, 7000 or something. It won't, won't because um, what... I can't actually poke it, but if you can see the microchip there in the middle, that holds the code for uh, the LCD display, and uh, it it won't say what you want it to say. It'll say something else. Um, there you are. There's your there's your cost headphones, forty seven dollars. Hmm. Right, eh? Uh, audio board. Right. Basically, it's a it's a a copy. Um, or something of the board that goes into those uh, batteries. It's exactly the same uh, layout. I can see by looking that uh, it's just a whole board, 57 bucks. But, you know, what's this? There we go. More um, Mylar strips. You know, you'd, you'd be really hard pushed trying to work out what's what. Here we are. What's this here? This is an interesting one. I'm going to click on this. $1,090.67. Buy three, get one free Mine Lab GPX 5000 API Gold Metal Detector. Blue. Blue. Oh, it's a blue one. Uh, four coils, headphones, and batteries. There you go. Right. Now, at face value, you can't tell the difference, can you? You'd say, oh, that's all genuine, right? Um, yeah, oh, it looks genuine, perfectly genuine, you know. What else we got? Pictures. No, it's all the same pictures. But uh, there you go. You can buy a $5,000 detector, um, you know. <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing because it's just, to me, <laughs> to me, my opinion, <laughs> right, <laughs> no, 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 not not a thousand dollars. No, 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 no. Be paying paying five grand or so. Um, pro, I love the promo offer here. This is this is a beauty. Buy two, get one free. Buy three, get two free. Heck, what? Buy five, get three free. What are they trying to do? Give them away? Buy ten, get six free. Um. Your privacy is guaranteed. Our prices are unbeatable. Of course they are. Um, secure transaction guaranteed. Yeah. Hmm. Yep. Uh, we provide reasonable... You'd think you're dealing with MindLab, wouldn't you? Yeah, but, you know, it's not... Dear me. It's just so... They've taken advantage of um, Christmas coming up and they've just gone and blasted this stuff everywhere. It was never here for, I looked at this probably about two weeks ago and there wasn't all these um, detectors, all these um, copy mine labs here. They just weren't here at all. It's just happened all of a sudden. It's just gone bang and out they've come. But anyway, this was um, uh, for the, uh, not the seven, because I did one on the seven, but just saying that uh, it's also um, happened for the, uh, other one as well, the 6,000, wherever it is, there, it's on here somewhere, there, uh, yes it is, that's him, so yeah, they're all over the place, there's all these um, knockoffs, so it's going to be a lot of um, very, very upset people, uh, whoever get these things and they don't perform, you know, I'd be really, really surprised if they perform as a genuine mine lab product, you know they're not because of the pricing, you know, if that was there and it was put up at six and a half thousand dollars, strain or you know four and a half or so us i i would you know sort of be in two minds saying oh that might be correct but the price gives it away it really does you can't buy it for that it's just impossible dealers couldn't get it for that no i can get it for that the only only way you would get that if it fell off the back of a truck um or it uh is not the genuine article so I really have no qualms in saying they're not genuine. They're not. They can't be. And I'll, I'll get a backup off Mind Lab on this as well. Um, yeah, I've uh, asked Mind Lab a few things lately, get their opinion or get the facts on things. So I'm going to give them a ring and uh, 
have a chat to them about all this stuff popping up um, on the e-commerce sites overseas and just see what they say. Because I, I think um, it needs to be uh, out in front of everybody. And, you know, any prospectors and, you know, detector are seeing this, you know, you've got a duty to go and tell people um, in the, in the, our um, hobby, um, you know, warn them so they don't get ripped off. You know, go and repost my videos. I don't care. Go and go and put it up there everywhere. I don't care less. Whatever. Do what you want. But uh, this is just um, bad. Anyway, so it, we've got um, fake 7,000s, fake 6,000s, and fake 5,000s, and I wonder what else is coming out. Catch us.